Don't look at my hair, y'all. I look like Jimi Hendrix. But what's up? Listen, I am so excited. Shout outs to Love CPT. I was watching one of her videos. She's new to budgeting. And I, I told her I was, uh, I told her that she was the reason that I finally was just like, yo, like I'm going to start. Because I watched her video and I was just like, I am obsessed. So shout outs to her. This is going to be a really chopped up video because not all my stuff is here yet. But I wanted to start tonight because I'm feeling good. My energy is like pretty chill tonight. It's like normal. So, and I'm crazy. So it's normal for me. So, um, I wanted, I loved her first video. She did a cash stuffing video and it was lit. It was really lit so i was just like you know what she's inspiring me i need to just go ahead and get started i cash stuffed two years ago back when the pandemic first started and unemployment was giving us crazy money i got like a thousand dollars a week and i didn't have no bills like but the problem is like i spent it all <laughs> so i'm starting over and i'm trying again and this time is gonna work because y'all gonna hold me accountable if y'all see me dip off for a few weeks, be like, yo, what you got going on? Like, confront me about it. Like, pull up. You see what I'm saying? Because, like, I need to stick to this. Why? Let me tell you why I'm doing this. We got to move out, okay? We've been in the parents' house since 1997, all right? I'm 25. I'll be 26 next year. So, we got to move out. And I'm not from New York, so anybody from New York, I'm sorry. I know sometimes when I get excited, I try to do one of y'all's accents, you know, so I'm sorry. But we got to move out. Um, I want to get a second cockatiel. I have one now. She's a love of my life, but I can tell she's lonely, so she needs a friend. So I need to get a second cockatiel um what else do i need to do i want to start my etsy business do i know what i want to do yet no but i do want to start an etsy business um uh, i would like a new car i want to get a truck a honda hrv i go i go to vegas next year in august i got a wedding in september so there are several different things coming up so it's not my wedding um, I'm forever alone, but um, it's my friend's wedding. So I want to get an actual like woman's suit for it and show up in a woman's suit because I think that would be really cool. So um, yeah, that's basically all the stuff that I have going on. So let me show you the stuff that I brought. <laughs> um, Is this Harry Potter? Am I... Am I literally Harry Potter? Like, is this Hogwarts? Like, I'm just confused as to why I thought that this would be it. I really thought that I ate when I ordered this. Well, I really thought that I ate. And so it's supposed to be like, instead of a binder, it's supposed to be multiple pouches. This is, it's a scroll. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. This is not a way to stuff money. This is a freaking amendment, <laughs> okay? I feel like all the presidents before me signed this or something. I don't know. It's just not it. I thought that I ate when I ordered this, and I didn't. I'm very much still hungry. So, yeah, I ordered two of them. So, these are going back to Amazon, but I just wanted to show them to y'all because I know a lot of y'all be getting started with Amazon stuff. So, you see it on Amazon. It's cute. Like, one's marble print. One is... So, it's cute, I guess, but, like, no. Uh, the budget sheets were in there. I did order budget sheets, and I chose purple. They come in purple, blue, green, pink, a whole bunch of different colors, but I got purple. So, I'm going to take the budget sheets out of those, though, because those are still good. Um, I have some extra labels. If anybody wants these, let me know. Um, they're really good for sinking funds. I didn't buy these for sinking funds. I brought these for envelopes for my wallet. Now, you guys might be like, girl, you're going to take an L. These are A7. This fits A8. Let me tell you something. I don't know how to manage my money. That's why I'm here. So... I have two wallets that I brought. 
so I have these A7 envelopes because I have an A7 wallet coming from Betty and Budgets. Then I have this one that I was just like, oh my God, it's so cute. And so I brought separate A8 envelopes off Etsy for this one. Why do I need two wallets? Um, so I, I paid like $60 for the one that the A7 envelopes are going to go in. But I'm not even going to use that one. I'm going to use this one and I'm going to use the envelopes that I got off of Etsy for this. So it's just going to be sitting ready to go whenever I use it. So I'm not even using these right now. But my categories are coffee, gas, groceries, eating out, pets. Parking, Dwokta, miscellaneous, tips, and receipts. So, I mean, yeah. By the way, shout outs to all y'all budgeters. I'm trying to figure out who's fetch rewards uh, to sign up with. You know what I mean? Everybody got fetch rewards and I want to sign up for it, but I'm trying to figure out, I'm trying to figure out who, uh, whose little code to use. I really want to use someone's code that's new, you know what I mean? Like a hustler, like starting out just like me, you know what I mean? So somebody throw their fetch rewards down below. So I'll sign up with your little thing and then you'll get the 2,000 points and I'll get the 2,000 points and it'll be all good. So these are the extra ones. So I put toiletries, what is that? Personal, date night, and uh movies, but I'm not going to use these. So, yeah, so I will literally send these to someone. So if somebody wants those, let me know. Um, other thing that I have, uh, I smoke. Um, it's for medical purposes. What YouTuber do you know that got scoliosis and arthritis? I'll wait. And the, they're 25. I'll wait. So I got this weed money envelope. I get my weed in bulk when I go to the dispensary I go to the dispensary like two or three times a year because I don't smoke often um and I buy like six hundred dollars worth of product because I don't just like no one cares Courtney damn so long story short this has to have 600 in it before I I go um and then the last thing that I have right now um Sorry, when I said right now, I started thinking about Marvin's room. Hello? Are you drunk right now? <laughs> Sorry. Um, I need help. I was dropped, y'all. Somebody dropped me as a baby. But, um, so these are bank envelopes. These are some pretty pastel ones. I got this off Amazon. Um, so one says vacation and retirement. These are going to be the actual accounts that I have at the bank. So I have like five binders that I'm going to have worth of stuff. But I'm only going to have eight accounts at the bank. Make it make sense. It doesn't. Um, so the vacation and then retirement. Treat yourself because you know what I'm saying. I have this Chanel bag that I really want and I'm going to try to save up for it and actually buy it one day. The the big Chanel, the, what is it? Like the jumbo, the yeah, the jumbo Chanel. I usually have like fake Louis Vuittons and fake Chanel bags. But nobody makes the fake version of the jumbo, which is like the biggest one. So I just want to go ahead and buy the real one. So I'm saving up to get the jumbo Chanel bag. Like, And once I get that bag, I'm not carrying nothing else. So, yeah. Bills, bills, bills. Um, so yeah, I want to be like 3 to 6 months ahead on bills so that when I do move out, I'm not stressing, you know what I mean? Like if I need to leave my job cuz they're not treating me right, but I already moved out and I got this place that I'm paying for, then I want to be able to have a couple months leeway to find a new job. So I want to be three to six months ahead before I even leave. Um, pets. 
I have two cockatiel. Well, I have one cockatiel right now. I'm getting a second one. But in the future, I want a Doberman and I want a Rockweiler. I love dogs as well. And puppies and dogs are like not cheap nowadays. And they're always getting sick when they're puppies because they're always eating something they're not supposed to do, be eaten. And now you got to pay $5,000 at the vet. So we're not going to have to worry about none of that. You know what I mean? Um, so we're going to get this together. I want to see this get to 10K before I even think about getting the first dog. And then, because, you know, puppy, it's almost a given that they're going to get into something and you're going to have at least a $3,000 bill within their first two years of life. Like, it's literally almost a given. Um, so home and kids. I don't have no kids right now, but you know, I got a breast reduction in February, so I can't breastfeed. So Infamil is expensive. I might not be a mom, but I know. I go in Target. I go in the baby section to get my little baby wipes. I see how much Infamil is. We're not going to wait till I actually get pregnant to start saving up because it's expensive. So I put kids, but in the bank, I think I'm going to call it family. You know what I mean? So I'm single right now. Mm, if anybody has an African brother out there, I'm just kidding. I'm not though. Um, so, and then I have this one that says emergency. Um, so, you know, if something comes up, you know, you have to be able to save for it. So that's everything I have right now. I'm going to save this video. I'm going to hold on to it and then I'm going to come back when more stuff comes in the mail i got some pom-poms in the mail for all the binders so one of the binders is purple so i have a purple one blue one pink one green one and then one of the binders is white so i just have this one i know five binders right and that's what these are for so i can like have them all lined up um so yeah, I know five binders is a lot and that's not even including my wallet, but you guys will kind of see how I have them spread out once they get here. Um, I got this, which I haven't opened yet. It is a coin jar. So, not this looking like somebody returned it. Um, uh-uh, it was like, did somebody return this? Like, okay. Why does it come with a screwdriver? Um, but basically it's like a self counting jar and it's supposed to be purple. This looks like a bluish kind of purple in there. But um, basically it's supposed to be able to count US currency, um, convenient twist off lid, nobody gives a crap. No one gives a rat josh. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, so I'm not gonna embarrass myself and try to like turn it on and figure it out like on here with you guys, but um I do get a self-counting coin jar so that as soon as I hit like 100 or 150, I know and I can just go to the bank and get that money out. So um yeah, I got that. Some denomination cards but i kind of talked about these in the other video but i did have to get two new cash breakdown i didn't have to get two but i got some new breakdown cards because um the other one that i had during the pandemic i lost it and then the only other thing that's came in is my money tray so I, um, I actually do have some more mail coming today, so later on today, I definitely can get back on here and show you guys, but um, little money tray, so 100s, 50s, 20s, 10s, 5s, 1s, and then I'll have an extra. So yeah, I just got the cheap little basic one for now. And I can put the money here. Can you guys still see that? Not really. It would have to be like here. 
I gotta figure out my setup still. It's a work in progress, but um, should I put it here? I guess, and then the binder here. Would you guys be able to see the binder? Not really. So I still gotta figure that out. Like I still gotta figure out how to make more room. I think I need to push my light back some so I can get more space. But yeah, I did get the little acrylic jar. So I'm a fan of Demon Slayer, the anime. And you know how some people are putting like the keychains on their budget binders? So I'm gonna do a Demon Slayer theme. So there is, what's her, Nezuko? Zenitsu? Um, the other ones? <laughs> so I'm forgetting their names, but um, yeah, so I'm gonna put those on my binders as well. So these are so cute. I'm gonna have an extra one, I think, which is fine. So maybe I'll put one inside my wallet. Um, but yeah, so those are those. What's this one? Ooh, this one's the binder I was telling you guys about. Okay, so this is from the Crafty Rose. I think I placed another order with her. So I tried to go to Disney for my 25th birthday that passed and I didn't have enough money. So I said, you know, one day when I get married, I am going to go to Disney World for two weeks for my honeymoon instead. Because I'm not the type to want to sit on a beach and drink alcohol. Like, like that's... We can do that anytime, but can you go to Disney World and be a kid for two weeks? Yes, that's what I would rather do on my honeymoon. So she makes a purple one and a pink one. So I got the purple one. And it has like some pockets. Pocket over here. It's really holographic and cute. And then we have hotel, plane ticket, park ticket. Dining with a cute little chicken leg, snacks, and then souvenirs. So um, I'm going to do it the right way. So this is for my portion of a honeymoon later on. So um, that's what this binder is going to be for. Uh, I probably will put like a puff ball on here because I think that would be cute. So I'll probably have to get another puff ball. I think I have another purple one over there. But yeah, so this is going to be the Disney binder. Like I said, I'm not even in a relationship right now. So I'm going to stuff this like slowly. But um, yeah, I'm going to take my time with it. So that's that. First binder. Okay. You see me? Sorry about that. Um, and then she gave me the sticker, be the reason somebody smiles today, period. So I have this one. Sorry. No! So then I have this one. Ooh, this is from um, Budget Baddie, right? Baddies and Budgets. Why do I always say it the wrong way? So this is the uh, this is the A7 binder that I got. This is so cute. It's like rose gold too. So rose gold, fun fact, is the only kind of jewelry that I wear. This is so cute. So you got like pockets over here and then you got like room for your ID and you could slip something in here. You could slip something back here. Um, you have like another little ID window, some more card slots, some more card slots, room for change. You can slip something back here. And then the big, oh, this is so cute. I'm not even gonna lie, I really want to use this one now. It's so cute. So this is, um, I think I talked about it in the other video. This is what I'm gonna put these envelopes, just these little like self-made ones. 
they're gonna go inside this binder. Um, so I gotta figure out what wallet I'm gonna use, whether I'm gonna use this one or the other one, because if I use this one, I wouldn't have to carry a change purse around because there's like a change section in the back. And I would be able to carry all my cards and then some. And then I could even have like room back here for receipts. So I wouldn't even have to carry a receipt holder like I do now. With the other one, you gotta have a separate receipt holder, a separate change bag. So I don't know, we might use this one. I don't know what we're doing. So that's that. There's one more. Do the way I hold these scissors make anyone nervous? <sighs> What is this? <gasps> Ew. Okay, sorry. Ooh, okay, so we will get to. Thank you, Courtney. Okay, so this is from Mel's Budget Designs. And these are the envelopes for the A8 binder. The other one I was thinking about. Oh my god, they're so tiny. So we have gas, groceries, eating out, pets, toiletries, Dunkin', because we love a good Dunkin' Donuts, date night, which is not happening right now, tips, parking, appointment, miscellaneous, and receipts. So let me get the other binder and we can compare and we can see which one we would rather use, whether we're gonna use the A7 or the A8. But um, let me see what extras she put in here. Ooh, she gave me a scratch off challenge, I think. Your order made my day mini scratch off savings challenge. So she gave me a scratch off. Um, this is her business card, which I'm gonna keep. I'm keeping everybody's business card. And then we have the sticker. It says, when you can't find the sunshine, be the sunshine, period. And then this sticker, make time for your art. It's important. That's really cute. So I really like, like look at how, where's the gas one? look at these in comparison so this is this is a8 and then this is a7 that's so cute i don't know what to do now let me get the other binder and we can figure it out um give me a sec okay so this is how the binder would look so we have like a little cover thing in front and then we have gas groceries eating out coffee Pet care, doctor, tips, miscellaneous. Um, she's kind of thick, I'm not going to lie to you. Because I think I have too many, I have too many envelopes in here. Um, so what could we get rid of? I get, the only thing I think I can get rid of is doctor. Like if I'm going to the doctor, I'll just like put money somewhere else. Okay, this is a little bit better. So that's this one. And that's like, it's just stiff right now because it's new. That's not including like coins or anything like that. But it's just stiff because it's new. And then you put the little thing on it. That's really cute. Um, let's see about this one, though. If we want to, how would this one look? Probably do gas, wouldn't do receipts, miscellaneous. I would want to do appointment, tips, don't have to do Dunkin', don't have to do Dunkin', okay. 
these would all have to fit. So, guess. Groceries. Eating out. Pets. And I'll change this later. I just want to like dunk in. I just want to see something. Tips. I'll rearrange this like later though. Appointments. So they, all the envelopes fit in this one. Uh, does it zip though? I kind of have to like push it in there. It fits though. Oh, does it? Kind of like jamming it up. So I wouldn't be able to put, okay, well I guess that answers that. I can't use this one. Why is it jamming? See, it's like a little bit too long. Hmm. I'll have to get one that doesn't zip. I don't know. I don't get that. I've seen other people do it. I don't get that, but um, I guess there's too many of them in here. Uh, I don't know. Regardless, I'm not really, I love the envelopes, don't get me wrong, but I'm not filling using this system now that I have it in person. Because I would have to carry, like I said, a separate receipt holder, a separate coin holder, and uh, a whole separate wallet if I do the other system. So I'm, I'm happy I got this one. I got it literally the day that, um, oh, I'm going to say it wrong again. Yeah, baddies and budgets. Oh, I love how she has her like little stamp in here. I got it literally the day that it became available. I found out about it two days before and then I brought it. So the purple with the rose gold, and this is quality. Like it'll last a really long time. So I'm just gonna stick to this one. How does she clip hers? I've seen her do it in her videos. Like here, so I clip it here. Oh, okay, yeah, I clip it here. That's really cute. That's really stinking cute. So I'm just gonna keep this in my purse. My purse right now is big enough where it can hold something like this. So, um, yeah. The only thing about this is I did have to take one envelope out, but it's not the end of the world. So yeah, I guess we'll, we have two of our binders already. Like, that's so cute. We have our wallet and we have like a little, Disney one for the future so I really like that a lot um all right so I'm going to do a part two because this video is getting super long um so I'm gonna have to do a part two of the rest of the stuff that comes in so tomorrow Sunday I'll probably get this edited tonight and then posted on Sunday but I'm obsessed with this binder I'm obsessed with the envelopes they're so cute I will be figuring this out and I will be like using this system like in the future when I get tired of the other one. Um, we'll figure it out. But right now I'm in the process of having to work two jobs. I don't have time to be like fidgeting around with all those pieces. It's like a whole separate wallet, a coin purse, a receipt holder, nah. I just wanna be able to put my coins back here, my receipts, back here and then all my cards in here and then I have my cash envelopes I'm just so busy right now it has to all be one thing so yeah um, I really love it I'm so happy that she did the rose gold with the purple one because I think the blue has silver and then the green has gold so she did a different hardware for every new color and I'm just very thankful that she did rose gold for the purple one because it's literally me in a binder. Like my favorite color is purple, but the only jewelry I wear is rose gold. So that's really exciting. All right, I'm going to stop talking and clean this whole mess up. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for part two. And I promise we are eventually going to cash stuff. I'm just getting all my things together right now um, so that it's like a smooth transition 
next year into cash stuffing. So I appreciate you guys and I will catch you next time. Peace.